Well, what's really exciting about Perdido is it is Shell's first production spar. It's in ultra deep water, nearly 8,000 feet of water. I've been on Perdido since November 2004. So I, I came on just at the start of system selection. So I was part of the team that selected a spar as the, as the hull. I uh, have seen through the design of the spar and the mooring system. The mooring system is a nine-point system made of polyester and chain that is used to keep the hull in position during storm events. The environmental criteria is very severe. We designed for a 100-year hurricane. We also designed for the 1,000-year hurricane. So we can withstand those large events. Another challenge on the mooring system has been placement of the anchors. Because the seafloor is, is so difficult and rugged, we've, we've actually had to, to, to think about how to orient the spar and also to think about how far out the, the anchor points can be. Remember, we have a canyon running to the north, so we actually have anchors on the other side of the canyon. Now, this particular mooring system is made up of polyester rope and chain. This will be Shell's first application of a polyester rope mooring system. We've used polyester previously for a calm buoy, but we've never used it for a production system. It's almost 150,000 feet of polyester rope, so that's, a, that's an awful lot of uh, polyester. <laughs> this is not the polyester that's in your, your shirts from the 70s, right? <laughs> this, is, uh, this is a high-tech material. The mooring system configuration has, has chain up at the top near the, near the hull, comes down the side of the hull, out what's called a fair leader, into the water column. There's then a long length of polyester, maybe say 10,000 feet of polyester, out to another short section of chain at the seafloor, and then to a pile anchor, and, and that's the mooring system. There are nine lines that make up the mooring system. And, and the design of the mooring system is not just to keep the, the hull put, but to keep it actually within a pretty, pretty tight tolerance. I mean, we're, we're talking about offsets of, of maybe a couple of hundred feet. And, and you know the water depth at Perdido is nearly 8,000 feet, so the mooring system really has a, has a tall task, a tough job to do. The mooring system is versatile in terms of moving the, the spar host around a, a number of locations. Remember, the, the wells are, are on the seafloor and are dr drilled directly from the spar hull. So you want, you want to get the spar directly over that well to, to drill it. So the mooring system serves that purpose as well, just to move the spar hull over the wells. It's been a very challenging design, uh, particularly given the deep water at, at Perdido. This is uh, the deepest spar production facility that will ever have been installed. 